Hello guys, I'm back with another video. This is the Nishman Kanta and this is my YouTube channel In Thirst of Knowledge. And this today's video to show you how to install SQL Log, uh, which is a, another GUI interface that we can be used to access the database present in the remote location. So without setting up all the uh, process in our system, we are just logging in, giving credentials, and then we just log in to that. Uh, so without getting late, let's get started. Uh, so before we start, first let's go to the Chrome and just type SQL Yoke download. Then you will see the page like this. So before clicking on the links, do check that uh, there are some third party website which process these applications and give to you which contain more and more number of uh, uh, ads in it and uh, these are the Morpho software so please don't go that way so you just download uh, this thing webyoke.com slash product slash download okay you just click on this thing and you can see SQL yoke we are having a mon yoke and SQL yoke we will be preferring the SQL yoke and this is a paid version and uh, you need to buy this thing since uh, most of the companies present outside will be using this software which is it is very simple and easy to use so whenever you click on this thing will get uh, your email id you need to submit your email id through which your link will be mailed i have already uh, get the got the download link so here it is the link here the email will be like this so just go on and download 64 bit if your windows is a uh, 32 bit then you can download 32 bit mine is 64 bit so I'm downloading 64 bit so it will be seen like this since I have already downloaded it I'm cancelling this thing so click on it and it will be ask you for several permissions input those permissions give those permissions and we get a screen like this then select ok and then next and accept the terms and conditions next make sure you check all these things make sure you don't get any other plugins here so that's all it has finished the installation so now let's see let's run this thing it need to install the ui also so since it is a 14 day trial let me try this thing yeah here it is so now we need to create a new connection called i'm creating it as a root i'm creating a password connect you do like this means it will not connect so you need to have a separate login credential so of the remote uh, remote database or the remote server you need to have those credentials and you need to enter those things here so after entering those things here you will be able to log in to the remote server and access the database present in so simply so here what i say is it's just a front end or it's a gui interface where you need to connect with the database present in the remote location in that cases this kind of sql log will also be useful so i had another thing also which is called hid sql so in the next video i'll show you how to download that hid sql and install that thing that thing also will be similar to this thing only so that's it guys that's it for for this video if you like this video please subscribe to my channel in thirst of knowledge thank you guys thank you for watching